Hey there, Motorcycle.com viewers, Troy here, and if you may have noticed by now in a few of our videos, you might have noticed that I talk into the camera, or more like the microphone, as I'm riding the bike. And as you probably know if you've ever tried to record audio while riding a motorcycle, getting good, clean audio is really hard to do. You gotta fight with wind noise and engine noise, and just finding something small and compact that'll work is really hard to do. Thankfully, I think I might have found a solution. It comes from our friends at Heliquip, H-E-L-E-Q-U-I-P dot com. It's this, the Helmic 3.1. Actually, let me take off this cable here. Actually, it's just this. This is the microphone that we use, or this that I use, to record onboard audio on the motorcycle as I'm riding the bike. This little thing right here comes from Heliquip. It's called the Helmic 3.1. And really, all this is is one of our readers commented on one of our videos about how poor the audio quality was. And he said, don't just take my word for it. Check out my videos and see the audio quality for yourself of my microphone. And so, sure enough, I clicked on his video, and the audio quality wasn't that bad. And he was using this to record it. All this is, is a 3D printed case with a lot of foam inside of it with the microphone internals cased within it. It's not very fancy, but it works really well. And the best part, it's only 30 bucks. Granted, in full disclosure, they sent us this one for free for a trial run to see what we think about it. But 30 bucks, I'll gladly pay you 30 bucks, I'll equip guys, for this microphone. It's a really good deal. It comes just like this in a variety of colors. Black, this translucent clear color, uh, orange and yellow, and maybe even red too, I think. It also comes with this uh, eight inch long 3.5 mil jack that you put into microphone like that and then you connect this end to the audio adapter for a GoPro or whatever action camera you want to use to capture your footage and then this piece the microphone itself goes into your helmet on the chin bar with some velcro you just snap it into there into the chin bar of your helmet with some velcro and you're on your way as for the actual camera itself, Heliquip sells a mounting kit for GoPros and other smaller sized action cameras that goes right over the chin bar here. And your camera goes on front and the eight inch cable goes from the microphone to your camera and you're done. But since I wear a variety of helmets, I didn't want to just have it fixed onto one helmet. So I actually use a different mount to uh, mount the camera to my helmet. It's a whole different category, a whole different subject for another time. The point of this review is to one, show you what I use, the Helmic, show you how small it is, show you how affordable it is, 30 bucks, then show you how good it works. And if you've already seen some of our videos before, you've probably already seen the audio quality that comes from this little microphone. But just to be safe, we're gonna go on another ride and talk about this microphone specifically and see how it performs in the real world. So come along and I'll show you how this thing works in the real world. So cruising along in just regular city traffic, the audio quality is quite good, but on inferior systems or even just putting like a lapel mic underneath your helmet kind of a deal, you could face some wind issues already on some of those kinds of mics. So we're picking up a little bit more speed now. We're about 40-ish mile an hour. And you can still hear me fine, I, I assume. And as we pick up some more speed, I imagine the audio quality is still plenty good enough to, to hear me just fine. Just for fun, I'll stand up to get one, some airflow because I'm kind of hot in my jacket, but two, so you can also see how the audio is 
when I stand up and just get the full blast of air into my face. I think you'll agree the sound quality is pretty good. I'm only I'm going about 50 mile an hour right now. You can probably hear the engine sound underneath me, the exhaust note underneath me. That's the cool thing about this microphone setup too is that it blocks a lot if not all of the wind noise, depending on the kind of bike you ride, the speed you're going, the amount of wind protection you have. We are maybe going 40-ish mile an hour. And even at those speeds, if you had used just a lavalier behind your trim bar, you would have definitely heard some wind noise. So we're gonna hop on the freeway here. And you can get a sense of the sound quality once we're at a little bit higher speeds. So here we go, we're gonna take this turn, it says 30. We are gonna go a little bit faster than that, of course, because that's what we do. So we're going about oh, 50, 60 mile an hour. You might be able to hear a little bit of wind noise, but it's not a whole lot. And now I've used the same microphone on a racetrack going 170, 180 mile an hour tuck behind the bubble and yeah at that point you can hear some wind noise but come on at 180 mile an hour impressive to hear some wind noise at that speed and still be able to hear clearly what I'm saying. This is 100% made in the USA. Hell equipped is one guy. He's one guy in Texas who 3D prints this at his house. I imagine you can hear what I'm saying just fine. I'll pop my head up over the windscreen. In fact, that's just exactly where all the wind from the windscreen is being diverted to is right to the microphone right now. And audio quality is still really good. If you've got a cool exhaust note that you want to capture but don't want too much of the wind noise to get in the way, this Hell mic works great for capturing that noise in the background while still capturing your voice in the foreground for, you know, moto vlogging purposes or of course what we're doing here at Motorcycle.com. So that's it. That's my quick review of the Hell Equip Hell mic motorcycle vlogging microphone again it's 30 bucks we'll have a a link in the description or you can just go to healthequip.com we'll put the uh, title the website right over here somewhere on the screen so you can see what the website is to purchase for yourself again this is one guy in texas who's building these things out of his room in his house with a 3d printer and it works really darn well. So support the underdog. Tell him you heard it here at Motorcycle.com that his hell mic works really well if you like this video. And happy riding, happy moto vlogging if that's your thing. And we'll see you next time. See ya!